watch this video and see how actress Toyin Abraham don't come back to her senses. She don't come back, they beg P2B and the entire Labour Party people, especially the obedience over her recent action during the general election that happened in Nigeria. She came out to beg over what happened. Say her film, Malaika, no they sell at all. Even people complaining from Ghana, her fans, they complain. In short, make on watch this video before I conclude what thing happened. Make on see. So I came to the mall to come and watch a movie. So my girls wanted to watch a tribe of Judah, but I have watched it already last week. Okay, so when we got here, I decided that, okay, why not? Since they are watching a tribe of Judah, let me also watch Malaika. To see. Guys, guess what? Guess what? I walk into the cinema and I am the only uh -huh. person here. Wow. I think we have to celebrate. See, that the fat only her Jesus. Like evidence day. Mad. And they be on the big AC for her. A single soul. Why? God. Ghana is why? Everybody is all about you. See, this is Ghana. This is Ghana. Not Nigeria again. No. They hate rich Ghana. How many times do I have to say? I wait for the family. Guys, like this is Ghana. It's not even Nigeria. Like the Nigeria on trended last week. How she came at um, Maryland Mall in Ikeja, and everybody was buying tickets of Funka Kindele movie. That is a tribe called Judah, and no one is buying Malaika. She had to use her ticket and start begging. Please, I'm sorry, you guys should buy my movie. It's interesting. She started using her hand to do the promotion advert physically. Yet. People ignored her like as if she's no more their favorite. Like, why Nigerians like that? Why? At the end of the day, she 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 left with anger, and ticket wasn't sold at all. Even Funka Kindle movie is five thousand for the movie. Yet her own is three thousand. Yet nobody is watching Malaika. Funka Kindle movie has surpassed one billion one billion naira sales recently and broke another record. Yet Malaika is not even showing any record breaking nor even streaming at all on cinema. It's very bad that Nigerians actually keep things when when they cancel you, they have cancelled you. I thought it's a joke when they say we are cancelling this person because of her actions. I thought it's just no matter. But I'm seeing it now from Naramali, Zinoliski and Doin Abraham. Like it's it's really it's really real. It's really real in Nigeria when they cancel you, they have canceled you. So the cancel culture really exists though. I pray that culture doesn't meet me on this my blogging platform. <laughs> so please, if you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe. If you are my old subscribers, let's continue to grow the community in love as usual. Drop a nice comment on what you think about this and don't forget to like, comment and share. So now, what is the reality of Toyin Abraham? to be brought back from being cancelled because she has actually opened up and pleaded with obedience labor party and peter be all this player one no but different branches do so i don't know i don't know what will be her fate but let's watch whether her movie will start grooming since she have actually begged but she she really did us dirty every hashtag was ashiwaji baby ashiwaji baby now i believe ashwaju baby should go and watch the ashwaju movie <laughs> nigerians are really are really into it so congrats to congrats to funke akindele on her movie congrats to her and big ups to many more that is coming to her she really deserves it and more she put more her hard work on that movie but actually i've not watched it too I will not watch it. And I heard that you guys have actually leaked that video on Telegram. Please, Nigerians, please have mercy. Have mercy. Someone just released movie not if, not not up to a month ago, and you guys are already like pirating the movie on Telegram. That movie is out on Telegram now. And people are even selling that movie on Telegram. One thousand two hundred. One. So I woke up this morning and I have been seeing a tribe called Judah poster everywhere on my WhatsApp. And I am wondering what is going on, what happened with the movie, what happened with Funke. Only for me to find out that, I don't know why the that is too much, but that they've leaked the movie. 
a movie that is barely a month old somebody sweats and blood and investment they've leaked the movie and the craziest thing is that i am going through tiktok and i am seeing people posting namumu they go cinema that is not even the end though people are now selling the telegram link for 1000 naira one two one five and two thousand naira like is this not the height of wickedness like nigerians we are the first program of this country nigeria because i don't understand why you are you are just wicked my question is who leaked the movie like i don't even know i'm just really pissed because as a business person i know how sad and how angry i would be if this happened to me and people are making a living out of it like i don't even understand people are rejoicing that okay they are going to watch the movie for free now or they're going to watch it for one thousand this is crazy this is somebody's investment like sometimes i just want let, let's come and happen to these people that's just the truth me i am not watching that movie on any link i will go to cinema and i will watch the movie because karma will happen to those people that are ruining somebody's sweat I go back to that black member. don't forget i thank god for my subscribers my phone and my sub if you like if you comment if you subscribe i'll keep thanking god for you i love you all